So how have you noticed um, this wind turbine changing the community and your schools? I believe that uh, the community has really ra uh, rallied around this project because it's so unique for a school district to own a wind turbine. It's a really big deal in Ray. Um, who can tell me what renewable resources are? Renewable resources are over and over again. So, um, what would make a renewable resource? Wind. The power purchase agreement with the city is going to generate revenues that we can use to offset our electrical increases, our heating utilities, all of those things. As well as it's going to hopefully subsidize some areas that we've lost in student count so we can, you know, continue to provide the best educational opportunity for our students. So what's it like living in Ray and having this much wind power and what does it feel like to you guys to know that you're generating clean power here in your own community? Really cool to um, be able to have something that can contribute to not having as much pollution at, for like when you're using energy. Running properly it'll provide about a, a fifth of the power of the, of the city so three and a half million kilowatts or more in a year. The community's very much embraced this and we can get anything done if we put our minds to it. By purchasing your carbon offsets through Native Energy and the DNCC, you're supporting projects like the Ray Wind Turbine. Please offset your travel when coming to the Democratic National Convention in August 08.